Law enforcement agencies across the Carolinas have a new crime-fighting tool that's proving to be a big success. They're using special cameras to read license plates, giving them clearer pictures of cars involved in crimes. Queen City News reporter Brett Baldick is live in Uptown with a look at how this technology is being used here locally. Brett, good morning. Good morning, Ann Wyatt and Jason. These cameras come from Flock Safety, and they feature automated license plate readers. Investigators say 90% of property crimes go unsolved, but these cameras not only help bring more evidence to court, but they can also catch criminals faster. In most neighborhoods across the Carolinas, you'll find plenty of cameras. It could be on a doorbell for security or a traffic camera. The cameras from Flock Safety aren't looking necessarily for people. So our technology focuses on cars and license plates. And that way, if there is an incident, um, police can get the information they need to go investigate and solve a crime, which is the license plate details. Deputies at the Alexander County Sheriff's Department say the Flock Safety license plate reader hit on a stolen car last month. Investigators say these three suspects were found in the stolen car and they now all face various charges. In Union County, the sheriff's office doesn't own any flock cameras, but local neighborhood associations do. We've seen, we've recovered numerous stolen vehicles. We've been able to identify suspects in incidents such as like a drive-by shooting. Response times to these crimes are now faster. When a license plate camera gets a hit in Union County, a designated investigator is notified, and that person then dispatches deputies to the area within minutes. We can figure out where that deputy needs to be and, and basically put resources uh, in the right place to stop crime in our area. But of course, these cameras collect license plates of those not committing crimes. Flock safety leaders say the data is permanently deleted after 30 days. There aren't a lot of laws on the books that tell you exactly how long this data needs to be retained. So we went really conservatively. Flock safety leaders also tell me they have 150 customers in North Carolina, but 100 of those customers are neighborhoods or HOAs, and these cameras typically cost between $1,900 and $2,500 per year, and HOA fees often pay for the cameras if they are set up in neighborhoods by the leaders of the HOA. Jason and Wyatt, back to you. Brett, this is certainly some important technology here. How does, how does the system work? Does it ever need updates like any other computer technology? So you heard me say that they have to pay per year, and that's because Flock Safety comes out and will upgrade the cameras basically for free as long as you're paying your yearly charge. And anytime there's an update or a new camera that comes out, they come and replace it. Similar to, I guess you could say, how the electric company works. Obviously, they maintain the lines. So Flock Safety, as long as you're paying your bill, will maintain these cameras for as long as you keep paying the yearly charge.